it's time to give this exotic a second chance because thanks to Season of Plunder it just got a huge build upgrade meaning you can fulfil that shield throwing Captain America fantasy you've always dreamed of in Destiny 2. With infinite melees, huge room clearing volatile explosions and the build is here right now in 3 minutes or less. This one never really got out of the starting blocks to be honest, it was underwhelming, it didn't deal with champions and it was ultimately Thanos snapped out of existence. But it's finally time for its redemption arc as we're in the end game now. It'll still give you that second shield throw melee ability and the intrinsic anti barrier trait did get a bit of a boost recently. Not only does your shield throw ricochet and track targets but it will also grant you a void overshield too. This combines with the offensive bulwark to extend its duration on melee final blows but also recharges your grenades faster and increases your melee damage output. Where it really shines though is with the unique synergy the shield throw melee gets not only with your top tier void free point or aspects and fragments but also with the new Pugilist perk and the right hook origin trait. With the range shield throw melee you'll trigger the right hook trait often and this will boost the stickiness of your favourite plunder weapon. Blood feud is awesome for this as it turns it into a high range SMG which then Pugilist will help to recharge your shield throw melee ability then with awesome perks like frenzy you can have near infinite uptime to make mowing down combatants even easier. But we're not really relying on blood feud or Pugilist for instant back to back melees it's just there for you if you get out of sync. The space magic of this build actually lies in an old Voidwalker setup rebranded for this Sentinel Titan. Chuck on the Vortex Grenade to pair with your Shield Throw and then we'll be taking advantage of Controlled Demolition. This will make everything volatile, triggering more damage output to targets and will allow your Shield Throw melee and grenade abilities to essentially chain near unlimited volatile explosions to targets, also granting you and allies health in the process. Echo of Expulsion will add further to this Void Chaos and is perfect if you're fed up of the Arc Chain Lightning this season. But the true power of this build all stems from the supremely potent fragment combo of the Echoes of Provision and Exchange. These will grant you melee and grenade ability energy on tap by damaging targets with grenades or on final blows with your melee ability respectively. And as you'll be chaining damage with volatile explosions, you'll be getting chunks back instantly if not a full recharge. But to get both shield throw charges back you might want some extra help from the heavy handed mod. Elemental charge, melee well maker and bountiful wells is definitely the way to go when putting this together to create tons of void wells to boost ability regen and make you charge with light for heavy handed to work. Momentum transfer and outreach are also ideal picks. Well of Tenacity will give you excellent damage resistance in this build and combined with a max resilience stat as well as the echo of leeching and at this point you'll be wondering to yourself what all the fuss over Laura Lee was all about. Perfect the Captain America comeback Avengers style with the Sentinel Shield Super and assemble this build for yourself using the Destiny Item Manager link down below. Now finish off this Void Titan build by watching this next video with another forgotten exotic that you should be using.